Zombie can have a huge impact on this game if he lands big curses, because again, they're playing without really good lockdown for the Slark. I mean, you have Doom, but there's no real stuns, so I am really looking at Winner's Curse to be a huge factor in this game. And I think the Wyvern can have decent impact. And it's a persisting disable. I think that's yep. a very important factor when it comes to curse him or you catch him inside of the A. We have the curse either way. Dark Pact is going to stop you. Rapido is going to be feeding away first blood. And Bombi will be giving up second blood. Bad oh, start for Zerg. They, I mean, they were spamming nukes and scorched earth. This Lark is worthless, so he's he just going to drain their stats, and he might just be dead again. If he's not dead, oh. he's going to be limping away on just a bit of HP. This is not looking good, because I'm going to assume a... This one, so, but blast off stun. Mine lands, Blood Grenade as well. Makoto needs the mana, and he popped the wand. He had just enough spells. This is a little bit concerning for me that Talon is walking away with a bit of the lead here, but this is a very important kill. They need this badly. Not that kill. <laughs> I was about to say. <laughs> the other one. given 23 more stats down here. Jeez, they're going to try and battle for six minute room, but they have the level six on Makoto, and JG does not. It's a tough fight. Oh no, blast off on to Makoto. Another oh round of the Astral Steps is gonna pop both of them. Oh no. If you're Bombi. Oh yeah, they need Q it. Is coming. They need it bad. Q. Is he gonna blast off for it? Does he wanna go for the Doom? Looks like he's gonna choose to go for the Wisdom Rune and he secures it for himself, even missing the blast off of the Burbus. And 23 doesn't even need the help with the kill. They still get Bombi on top of that one. The other side, wait, did Tihi steal? Oh, no, he didn't. Jab's got no. that one, too. Jab's got that die. and the kill. Oh. Once again, Power Rune's desperate for it. Needs it, needs it, bad, gets it. Regen Rune. Can he use it, though? Makoto has one more Astral Step to go, and they have a Bramble Roar on to JG. Can they finish him off? The Blast Off lands in time. He Astral Steps through Tihi and... They're going to try and run him down, too. They got axes to throw. Double kill. The Doom who can build auras. That's pretty crazy behind a Terrorblade. Nice dodge just, there. To be able to get there. If only you had a Winner's Curse. JG's going to come in off of that regen rune. 23 has already shown so many stats, though. He's going to turn it back around on JG. Now on a T, he just chasing away all these heroes. Oh, nice the connection. Off. The step on in, grabs the ember, finishes off Bombi with the hit of the tech. He's not quite enough. And oh, gonna get a young gonna get cute. He gets two. Chain Frost doing a lot of damage, but that's okay. As long as he doesn't die. All he almost oh, dies to the zombies. In Ooh, fact, he almost dies to the Splinter Blast. Hard to find these little openings. They, they found a couple. Unfortunately, Very nice. Young God needs help. Find Young God. The blast off lands. This time, there is no Sunder to save him. Ooh. There is a curse. Oh, them all. A perfect curse setting up JG's rotation, too. So both supports are going to die for this one. Ooh, and what was Young God on HP wise? That had to have been like 10 HP or less. Less than 10. It is an interesting itemization here. Blast off Skalan. Winter Wyvern dying to the magic. Oh, no, the Chain Frost bounced over and finished him off. That is unfortunate for him. They take the tower and the support's Radiant's life, and now they're going to start invading rune. some of this area. The Wisdom Rune late game, they also have... Uh... Oh, he might get the ult. Yeah, okay. this is ult in the Doom. Can't dispel yeah, that, my straight friend. Straight up Doom, slight, and a change would do it, but they don't even need that much. Slowed yep, down so much, he dies. Medium going, but it's just like some drunk guy hitting a drum. <laughs> <laughs> well, they're going to do him. Have a out. That drum put some damage on him. Glimmer the Shroud. Just staves him with the Depth Shroud. That is painful. Meanwhile, JG, he went for Ollie, but he can't really commit. Not with 23 Savage on him. Maybe he can. Rend it on through. Not quite enough. Ollie stays alive. T, he jumps out to finish him off with the Decay. Get There's him in the, the curse. End. There and it is. Saved. Oh, there's the curse. Onto the Beastmaster, too. A lot of damage. A lot of it being blocked, though, by the Crimson Guard and the Ember Spirit. Thought it was his time to shine, time to pounce in, but denied immediately. A primal roar stops him in his tracks, and Zersha. Now, one lane of barracks left away from Megas, and an early end to this game, too, and it's up to Young God. 
to repel them with a Sunder. Will do it at least momentarily, but Jabs keeps the beat going on and on and on. There is no end to the beat of this drum. I mean, there's some team fight hope there, but Jabs is just way too big and way too tanky. Even with 23 stealing all his stats, it just doesn't matter. Hop one miss, hop two lands, Rapido, blast off, finishes him off, Bombi crawling.